There are times when you receive imported base solid parts from others that need tweaking to match the real parts in your production environment. Other times, you need to capture the as-built modifications made on the shop floor. Or, you may wish to rapidly investigate possibilities for modifications to existing models without the impedance of the history tree. These cases are ripe for the use of direct manipulation. Direct manipulation allows you to quickly and nearly effortlessly make modifications to models with or without a model history. The model in the window is an imported single solid body representation of a bracket that has already had some alterations to match the as-built state of the model's real-world counterpart. You will continue altering the part using the rotate type of direct manipulation command. To begin, on the ribbon, 3D Model tab, Modify Panel, select the Direct Edit command. From the options along the top of the mini toolbar, choose Rotate. The Faces button is now active, so hover the cursor over the lower edge of the angled face of the rectangular structure in the center of the bottom until a circular glyph appears on the angled face along the edge, and then click to select it. A rotation glyph appears. The dimmed arrow indicates that a particular rotation direction is not possible. In this case, the profile cannot be rotated clockwise or counterclockwise, but the orange arrow shows that the direction you want to rotate, forward or backwards, is possible. Rotate the face minus 45 degrees outwards to remove the bevel on the face, and then click Enter. Rotate the model to expose the angled webbing on the opposite plate. Select one of the angled faces at the edge where it meets the box-like structure. At this point, the feature can be manually rotated using the manipulator, but an easier way to get the needed outcome is to use the now active Snap Parallel command. Select Snap Parallel and then click the upper face of the box-like structure. The rotated face snaps parallel to the selected face. Click Apply, and then perform the same procedure on the angled section directly across the part from the one you just rotated. The Direct Edit command is a very fast and stable way to make either static or parametric changes to models. Direct Edit is not a substitute for feature-based parametric modeling, however, it is a tool that should be used sparingly to correct problems in base solids where a proper parametric history is not available to do so. Used correctly, Direct Edit can save a great deal of time when working on imported models from suppliers or when a quick as-built model is needed to correct downstream documentation.